With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students, so today we have a question here is which of the following is not an example of commensalism? So what is this commensalism? So it is the association, it is the association between two organisms so this is the association between two organisms and what happens in type of this association in this association one organism is benefited is benefited and the other one and the other one derives so the other one derives neither benefit in which the other one derives neither benefit or nor harm so this is the this is the commensalism that is it is the association between two organisms in which one is benefited but the other derives other derives neither benefit nor harm so this is the commensalism so first option we have with us is orchid on mango branch so this is an example of commensalism and this type of organisms they are known as epi Fights. They are known as epiphytes. So this is the incorrect option because this is an example of commensalism. So the next we have is cuckoo and crow. So this is the correct option because cuckoo and crow these are not the example of commensalism. Rather they are an example of brood parasitism. So what happens in this brood parasitism? In this the one organisms is dependent on the other one for laying eggs for laying eggs or for the raising of their young ones or for the raising of their young ones so this is the type of brood parasitism not the commensalism so the next we have is egret and grazing cattle so this egret this is a kind of white bird white bird that that depends on this grazing cattle and it is benefited from this grazing cattle as it eats the ticks that lies on this grazing cattle. So the next we have is the last option we have is sea anemone and clownfish. So this is also the example of commensalism and in which in this the one is benefited but the other is not benefited nor harm. So the correct option we have is cuckoo and crow because the others are the example of commensalism. Because, but cuckoo and crow these are not the example of commensalism these are the example of brood parasitism as we discussed so this is the correct option to our question for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today